there everybody, my name is Sidra, and today we're back in Elder Scrolls Online. Uh, so, almost as usual, today when I'm recording they're gonna have maintenance again. It's, it's always on the day I'm recording, um, so, but it's in the time frame so we shouldn't have any problems. My horses are beautiful. As long as I don't make this episode, I don't know, way too long. We have half an hour in between uh, the end of the episode and the maintenance, so it should be okay. Okay, what did I want to do? I've just fed my mount. I wanted to go and do something about that Baleborn curse. Ah, uh, yeah, I remember that. That was um, either break the curse or tell him to leave. Okay, I thought about that a little bit. So, I was kind of thinking, maybe he was the son, and we should not break the curse, because then he would die. But, A, we do not know if he is the son, and B, we don't even know if he will die. That's what she presumed that would happen, so, maybe there is a happy ending still? So, I thought I may take the risk. It's risky, of course, but I'm gonna take that risk. So, for breaking, I need to go up here. So, I'm gonna do that. And hopefully, it's gonna be a happy ending and not, uh, yeah, all tears. Okay, now I have to smash this stone. And hope that nothing bad happens. Examine. Are you doing that? Okay. Um. Ah! The entity. I knew it was Daedra. I guess I have to kill you now. No, I haven't played the march in so long. Okay, no. I bet it works. What? What have you done? The deal has been broken. My my child, what will become of my child? Well, the Daedra you made the deal with is dead, so I'm guessing he can't do anything to your child. That's probably not a child anymore. I mean that's just a guess. And I tell him that everything's fine. Okay, let's do that. Oh, he's already inside the tower. Don't be short-sighted, my friend. Where you came from? Who you are? My head is pounding. I think... I think my name is Stefan. Okay. So, yeah, good thing I broke the curse, because my guess was totally off, so... It was literally protecting the child, so the Daedra was keeping it under a spell in here. That guy must have awful social skills now, and not know what life is. Poor thing. I walked in here, and this young man nearly fell on my head. And you? Were you successful? Yeah, curse is broken, place is all yours. Figured as much. It felt like the air shifted for a moment. When we tried to walk through the ruins, nothing stopped us this time. But as soon as we walked in here, this man fell out of the sky. We thought it was an ambush. Really, he whispered a name or something. Siniuk or Saniuk, something like that. He looked confused. And then he said, Themen. Do you have any idea what all that means? Yeah, that's the son that was missing. Which probably means that you're related in some way or another. But don't ask me how. Find it out on yourself. He's the son of the ghost that tried to kill me? Well, that's just great. I think he's hurt. But if he wants to pick up where his ghostly mother left off... If I took after my father, I'd put an end to the young man. It would be the prudent thing to do. But I never liked my father. There's been enough hatred between our families. It's time things changed. Of course, of course. You've certainly been more useful than these hired hands. The Baleborns are once again on their way to the top, and I have you to thank for that. 
I'll always remember the small part you played to make this happen. My part was actually pretty big, but okay. Have fun with your ruin of the house. Okay, now that is dealt with. Um, we still had quests to do inside the city, I guess. Oh, also the impact on me. So let's return and get that then. Um, what's the entrance? Just down the waterfall. Will I survive that? We find out. Oh no, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Well, at least it was fun. It happens. Ouch. When there's a waterfall, there are stones at the bottom usually. Okay. Let's go in here. Um, now we have to talk to someone over here. Yeah, that was the one with the assassination plan. Wasn't it that? I don't remember, actually. Let me see. Let's find assassin's plan to kill the king. Yeah, that was that. Okay. Now I'm on track. Let's see. Um, where's the person I need to talk to? And is there another quest? Yeah, it looks like a quest. For glory. Oh, battlegrounds. I don't think I'll do PvP. I will only fail. Oh, let me cycle through to the right quest again, because otherwise I'm lost. I admit. Where is the contact after me? Somewhere over here? This looks correct. Unless this is about cargo, I can't talk right now. I'm extremely busy. The assassins are in my port. Find these snakes and kill them. But do it quietly. I don't want to start a panic. I'll alert the guards. If any of these conspirators get past you, we'll cut them down. Okay, but where to look? That's a good question. Let's see. Um... I'll just go down and see. Yeah, could be hiding anywhere. Maybe on the ships? I mean, that's obviously not it. I need a break. Okay, probably on the ships. Where are you gonna try that? Ship number one. A book. And the knitter. So it's me gonna have to go up here. And down there, presumably. Okay, so they can be on either ship. Maybe they're on both. Let's search this. That's very suspicious. You're too late. Varric's already on his way to the castle. Your king is... Okay. Good, then. Why am I wasting my time here if he's already inside the castle? Then we return. That was a quick trip. <sighs> I really like the rain in this game. Especially today, because... It is pretty hot where I live right now, so... I also have my fan on back there. I hope it's not too loud. I hope it's not um, yeah. recording and kind of ruin everything. But I made a test yeah. recording before and I think it was only barely hearable or very yeah. quiet or not at all. So I hope this is the case. If not, I'm really sorry about that. But I think it will be okay. Ah, uh, where is the castle, by the way? Ah, it's over there. I'm running the totally wrong direction. 
Okay, then let's save the king. Total demise. Hopefully, I'm not too late. That would be bad. Then I have some explaining to do. Yeah, in the name of the king, I'm gonna save his ass. I'm seriously. In the name of the king. It's urgent. It's urgent. That's why I get a loading screen. That will take forever. Oh, well. Okay, now, sneakity sneak. Are there already assassins in here? Not. The dragon does not flee its lair. They're coming for you. Wait, what was that? Death to the king. Eh, there they are. Head ah. upstairs and get the king out of here. Go. Why me? Okay. Ugh. Where did he go? First fast MPC I've seen. What do we have here? A lizard with a crown. Okay. Stand in Angoff's way. Angoff. I know that name. Ah. A little close quarters here. Go. The king fled toward the stairs. Good riddance. Okay. Looks like they Captain, got it done there easy too. for me to say, but I want to apologize for ignoring your warnings. It was nothing, my king. I apologize if I was impertinent in my duty. Not at all, Arison. Rise, please. In service to Daggerfall, our friend here is to have any support the Watch or the Knights can provide. Of course. We'll do whatever we can to help find Angoff and determine his motives. All of Daggerfall stands behind our hero. Okay. At least nothing happened. It would happened. seem that the captain's concern for me was well founded. You saved me from this assassin's blade, as well as from my own foolishness this day. Indeed. The body on my floor proves that. Who was this man who came to kill me? What did he want? Yeah, so I guess next we have to go after Angoff then. Presumably. Angoff? I've heard this name whispered by my agents. The royal spymaster reports of unrest across my kingdom, stirred into a froth by this Angoff. But that's all we know. Creating chaos is a method, not a goal. It's a means, not an end. There's more going on here than chaos for its own sake. We must get to the bottom of this. Okay, then we're gonna investigate. Let's oh see. yes, my friend. I hereby grant you special dispensation to investigate the villain Angoff in my name. But you must keep this quiet, for we don't want to tip our hand. I shall never forget your service this day, however. Hey, we got a skill point. I take that gladly. Um, but does this quest lead somewhere new? Because I don't see anything. What's this thing saying? Okay. That's a little bit of foreshadowing here. I may have to leave and it will just, I don't know, pop out of nowhere. I mean, I just have to go to the villages, and there will be quests there that kind of lead me on. We're just gonna see. We're gonna try to get every quest anyway, so... It's not gonna be a problem. If we don't know where we need to go next, especially for the main quest line here. For the Knights of the King! 
Okay, do I have anything left that I need to do here? That's not having to do with anything else. Um, no? Yeah, I'm experiencing and I'm... That's the mother. Let's see what's not leading to the ship. Or anywhere else. No, no. Okay, um, which means we're gonna have to find a next quest. So I'm guessing out of the city it is then. There is a delf right on top, so maybe we're gonna go visit that. Salem, it's called. Yeah. I mean, it's one thing. Um, can I... Oh, uh, no. This is not working. I have to go, um... This method. Oh, no. I'll fall down again. We go around, and then we go into that delf. Then we're gonna see about everything else. I have no time for this. Mm, but they seem to be right on it. Leave me be. Okay, it is right there. Question is how do we get there? Probably from the beach. Ooh, some new material. Take that. There is a quest at least. Let's see what it is all about. Okay, they're friendlies. Hey, you. Wanna make a stranger a word? You look like the courageous type. I have an opportunity. You're sober, aren't you? Good. Are you interested in taking on a contract? Depends what I have to do. Nothing too dangerous. My father, Lord Dial, hired a group called the Daggers to investigate the Harpy threat. But they've been gone too long, and I'm beginning to worry. We don't want any blood on our hands when this is all over. So, I go and see what they are doing at the moment? Or what am I here for? Well, I need you to go and find them. You can take the one dagger who managed to find his way back to camp with you. He can fill you in on the details. I'd send my guards, but then they wouldn't be protecting me. I'm sure you understand. Yeah, of course. <sighs> okay, let's see what this is about. Do you know where all the, the rest of you are? You're going to help me find the rest of the daggers? <laughs> I'm not sure your dagger material. Your hands look kind of soft and delicate. Like you've never beaten anything into submission with your own two fists before. Well, I have a bow. That's enough for me. The daggers were hired to help Lord Deal gather research about the harpies. We get him what he needs and we get paid. Simple as pie. But now the rest of the daggers are missing. We need to find them and make sure our first mission is a success. Wait, this is your first mission? Well, it didn't really go that successful, did it? I would be thinking about another career. Everyone has to start someplace. Even the Fighters Guild had a first mission, didn't they? Who are you to judge? Now let's get out there and do what we're getting paid for. Let's find the daggers and bring back their research. Well, I would say they should kind of get a very simple job first and kind of work up from there kind of get some training but seeing that we're kind of in the beginners area you just failed harpies eggs whatever we can bring back so lord deal can figure out why these birds have become so violent lately maybe something has upset them we have to find the missing daggers gelvin our leader and the renly brothers we find them and help them finish their jobs and while we're at it, we look for the Queen Birdie, Fowling. She's a vicious killer, and she needs to be dealt with. 
Okay, I'm gonna ask you a few more questions, and then you're gonna get even more mad at me, but that's we shouldn't okay. Dawdle, so make it quick. Yeah, why don't you use a weapon? I mean, it's fine if you're doing fist fighting, but at the moment you don't look really trained or special equipped for that either, so I have no clue. I vowed that I would always face my opponents as an equal. If an enemy came at me with a sword, I would meet his blade with one of my own. The harpies fight with claws. How could I go up against them with anything more than the fists nature gave me? Um, I would not call that equal because they have sharp claws and you don't. But I don't think there's anything we can do about that right now. Sharp and natural. They don't wield weapons, so neither will I. I will fight them head on. Fists against claws. And I will do so with honor. Yeah, um... How did your group form, exactly? We're an odd bunch, that's for sure. Gelvin found each of us either drinking away our troubles or begging for gold on the streets of Daggerfall. We were good for nothing and all but forgotten. Gelvin wanted to change that. Hmm. Well, they might as well be dead now. Did not turn out so well. A few of us tried to join the city guard or hook up with the Fighters Guild. Truth be told, they wouldn't have us. We weren't good enough for them. So we formed the daggers to show them that they're wrong. And, uh, Lord Deal is probably for money, but I'm gonna ask anyway. Lord Deal's guards were in the city, looking to hire some muscle. They found us in the Rosy Lion, celebrating our newly formed partnership. We needed a job. Lord Deal needed some help. And here we are. Well, not really. We were talking about how we needed to find a job. And suddenly Lord Deal's men were making us an offer. We took it as a sign that we were doing the right thing. The daggers were going places. Okay, something about this sounds fishy. I have a guess that he knew that the daggers would kind of not finish this job, probably. But why is he having him rescued now? Maybe he changed his mind. I'm not sure. Okay, let's go up that hill. Um... That way would probably be better, but let's go to the far end and take that side. Because there are materials here, and we're gonna take these. I never heard. I'm gonna take your wood, is that okay? You can keep your fish. Hey. Hey, I see a chest, I guess. Yeah, there it is. Let's try our best. Ah, uh, me and lock picking. Well, at least it's open. Even though it doesn't contain anything too useful. Why am I even mounting up? Everything's full of materials here. Fishing cabin. I'm gonna visit this later. Okay, let's see. I see harpies already. And a trap. I'm not gonna walk into. Okay, the first person seems to be that direction. That's also a sky shark. Do you expect to trap a flying harpy with a trap set on the ground? You're an idiot. You know that, right? You know I hate it when you yell at me, brother. Now calm down and help me figure out how to get a harpy to trip a wire on the... Looks like we found the Remley brothers. Okay, so they are the ones that got the... the traps going, but they're obviously not working. But they mean well. At least they are trying. You have to give them that. Did Lord Deal send you? Well, there's nothing new to report except that my brother is an idiot. Armo placed dozens of traps and he just realized something. Harpies don't walk. Now we're trying to figure out how to salvage the situation. We're trying to capture a few of these creatures. Lord Deal wants to observe the harpies and see if they demonstrate any odd behavior that might explain the recent acts of aggression. But we're still working on our traps, as you can see. 
Yeah, you'll place the wrong ones. You think if I catch some materials, you could kind of craft some useful traps for once? We've got some throwing snares. The only problem is the damn harpies are too strong. They need to be weakened before you hit them with the throwing snares. I may have a sword, but I'm not a fighter. That's too dangerous an approach for me. So that's why I come in. Okay. Yeah, how many do I have to catch? Lord Deal said a few. So, four, I'd say. Yes, four harpies should do. If this works, please tell his lordship that we gave you the traps, all right? I mean, it's not of my business, but how is capturing harpies helping him in determining why they are aggressive? Won't that just make them more aggressive? Hmm. Oh well, not gonna think about it, we're just gonna do it. At least for now. Let's disarm that, by the way. Because that's useless, and I might step in it. This is a fresh kill. Be alert. Whatever did this could be watching us. Okay, but I don't see anything, so... Are we safe? Set up the hill to the next point. Ah, there she is. And now I'm gonna kill her? Or at least apprehend her. Let's try. Okay, that worked nicely. It was not too hard. Okay, I still need normal harpies. Don't see any around. Ah, there's one. And I better not run into any of those traps. Oh no. Okay, a lesson. Don't use your poison arrow if you want to capture something. Got that. Good that way? Can we now capture you? Okay, now it's working. Okay, my bad. Just killed a heartbeat before for nothing. Let's take this as well. Okay, there's something down there that I need to get, and I see another harpy too, so... Okay, what do I need to get? I think it's over here, is that up? Hmm... Okay, it might be on the hill, because I don't see anything. Let's get our harpies first, and then we're gonna see. Up up the rest. Oops. Don't kill you by accident, that would not be good. What are you still standing around for? Okay. That worked. Now we only have to find that person. Yeah, that means we're gonna have to go around this. Around and up. Ouch. Okay, somewhere here? Ah, there. Did you catch yourself? He's definitely in some sort of bind. Damn bird food before you got here. Um, hello. <laughs> that was a bit of a predicament. The Remley brothers do set a good trap, I must say. That one trust me up tight. But now that you're here... Wait a moment. Who are you? <sighs> and now they're going into their own traps. But this group is kind of um, stepping on its own feet, isn't it? Help. The daggers don't need any. 
Oh, who am I kidding? I'm the leader of the Daggers, and we don't have a clue as to what we're doing out here. If you're willing, we'd appreciate any help you care to provide. I was collecting unhatched harpy eggs to bring back to camp. One of the things Lord Deal needs to complete his research. I got one egg, but we need to collect a few more. In the nests above, be gentle with them. I don't want the hatchlings to come to any harm. I'm going to rest a moment and then head back to camp. With the gold his lordship pays us, the daggers can really make a go of this mercenary thing. Okay, so he wants eggs and he wants life harpies. I'm somehow getting a feeling that there is no aggression. No. At least aggression that um, in the beginning came from the harpies. I have a feeling he's getting that eggs and the specimens and gonna sell them to high bidders or something as exotic beasts and he's gonna pay mercenaries every time to do his bidding but this time he kinda hired the cheapest and it kinda went wrong so he sent me after hmm. and of course um, the leader of the harpies would be very aggressive after he did that for I don't know how many times already that's my guess at the moment. Let's see if it comes true or not. But it sounds kind of like that. He's definitely the sort of person that would do that. Okay, next egg. Two more to go. Let's see, um, is there an egg up here? There is none. And we're gonna take the next turn. Or are you gonna take the next turn? And I'm gonna go with somewhere else. We're gonna find two more. Shouldn't be a problem. There should be plenty around. Oh, she just dropped one. Freshly laid eggs. And the last. That's all that Lord Deal asked us to do. Let's head back, but I want to have a chat before we enter the camp. Okay, we can do that. I wonder if he kind of has the same suspicions that I do, because... As I said, they don't seem really aggressive. They only attack on me if I go into their territory. I don't think they would get out of their territory to kind of attack something out of there. It seems really strange. The leader was not planning anything either. She was just standing there. Okay, let's see. Let's talk here before we return to the camp. Let's have a talk. Listen, you've helped the daggers a lot, and we appreciate it. Um, but before we harpy? get back to camp, I need to make sure you understand something. There's that harpy behind you. I'm just saying. And she might be attacking, but I'm listening. Gelvin has a good head and a good heart. Always puts the daggers first and keeps us on the right side of the law. Of course, that's part of the reason we're still struggling. Sometimes mercy. Okay, how rude. I was just talking. Bad heartbeat. But I guess that's not the aggressions he was talking about. Maybe they don't like people talking. No. Yeah, I think that was Listen, just coincidence. You the daggers a lot, and we appreciate it. But before we go back to camp, I need to make sure you understand something. Okay, I've been here before. Okay, I'm listening again. Gelvin has a good head and a good heart. Always puts the daggers first and keeps us on the right side of the law. Of course, that's part of the reason we're still struggling. Sometimes mercenaries can't be too choosy about the jobs they take. Um, yeah, sure, but you can be different. It's okay, you might be struggling a bit, but having a good heart is not that bad. I think that's good. This Lord Deal, something's not right with him. Why does a noble care about harpies? But whatever, it doesn't matter. The daggers need to get paid. If not, our mercenary group collapses, and we're all back to the streets again. You're not listening. I'm saying that it doesn't matter. He could be a saint or Molog Ball himself. What matters is that we get paid so the daggers can stay together. Got that? Now let's get back to camp. 
I mean, we could also kind of do something about his bad plans and I kind of invest in you, make you a group. I have some money, not much. Is that enough? I hope so. Hopefully I can help in some sort of way. The way he's just gleaming at them is somehow really, really wrong. I don't like that. You can't keep them like this, Lord Deal. They're in pain. I can do what I like with them. After all, I'm the one investigating why these birdies have become so very, very angry. Ugh. When Gelvin gets back, he won't stand for this. Okay, so actually it is the father that's kind of behind the plants? That is the father, right? And I didn't remember the other guy, but he was younger. Now, you're back. Much more reliable than those damn daggers. I don't see their leader, Galvin. He didn't come back with you? More gold for the rest of you, I suppose. Now hand over the eggs, please. I believe we already covered that. Now let me have a look at these beauties. Oh, so round and smooth. Well, oval, really. I'll begin studying these eggs right away. Wait a moment. Okay, what's it now? Where's the other egg? I was promised five harpy eggs, not four. Didn't they teach you to count? There will be no deal without five eggs. Five, no more, no less. Imbeciles. Um, yeah, Galvin has the other one, presumably. Then I suggest you find that bootless lout and get it back. There will be consequences. These are my eggs. Let his sister know that if Gelvin doesn't return, I will have his right hand cut off for stealing from a noble. <laughs> Dealing with fools and idealists makes me thirsty. I need a drink. I do not like that man. Seriously. Me, ignorant, ugly son of a mammoth's ass. That deal can go leap in the river. That's exactly what I was thinking, but couldn't express in such a still consumer-friendly way. Thank you. I wish I knew. The rest of the daggers made it back, but there's been no sign of my brother. I had my doubts about getting involved with Lord Deal. I just wish I'd told Galvin about them. But who are you anyway? Why do you care about any of this? Yeah, I have no idea. I still have no idea. I'm just here because I don't know. I saw a quest tracker. That's to me for you, isn't it? Well, you helped my brother and his daggers so far. I only hope we can continue to count on your support. So listen, I heard Deal's threats. His claim is ridiculous, but he has gold. Paying guards to support a false accusation is easy enough. So what are we gonna do about that then? I think I know where you can find my brother. Whether you agree with Gelvin, me, or the bastard deal over there, we need to find Gelvin and that egg. I don't want to see my brother get hurt. There's a house on an island directly west of this camp. That's where we first met with Lord Deal. I could see that Gelvin was very interested in the place. I'll give you a head start before I tell Deal about it. Now go. Find my brother. Okay, so you might be investigating something. Oh, that's the fishing house, by the way. I'm gonna quickly unlock well, this point on the map. And maybe the wine shrine over there. So I can return here quickly. Unlock number one. Yeah. There are those vines everywhere. From the uh, assassins. Well, this might not be good. Okay, and now we go down to that house. Okay, they said that Galvin has a good heart, so he might be investigating the same thing that we do. Kind of, why he had to see need those harpies and the eggs. I wonder if he has more evidence than we have. I mean, I can just guess. But... So far, 
I was thinking that maybe they are selling them. I was kind of thinking about the son yeah. over here, but the father yeah. kind of seems personally interested. Maybe he has some sort of, I don't know. I don't know, strange hobby. He likes locking up harpies for his pleasures. I, I have no clue. He was kind of fascinated and... I don't know. By the X alone, I, I I don't get it. What's so What's so interesting about seeing an egg? Yeah, it's oval. You would have guessed. I have no clue what's up with that man. He seems really, really, really strange. Uh, also, there's a water skin here. I did not see. Where is it? Didn't I just see? Ah, there it is. So small. I mean, I can get the harpies, kinda. So, kinda like birdies in a cage, or... I don't know. Maybe just because they look female, I have no clue. But the eggs? Why is he so... Almost turned on by those eggs? They are just eggs. I don't get it. It's a very disturbed, strange old man. Let's see what we find here. Hopefully more evidence. Hopefully... Nothing too bad. Oh, I thought I could just... Ah, it's all empty. Maybe this? Nah, there's nothing. Something fishy's going on here. I think Lord Deal hasn't been entirely truthful with us. But how did you find me? Grinette sent you, didn't she? Yeah, she did. I know, I know. I was on my way back when I decided to investigate this place. When we first arrived, Deal and his sons came out of this building to greet us. I figured if there was any place to get any answers, it was right here. And did you find anything? Before I'm gonna go looking? Nothing yet, but this whole situation feels... off. I'm sure that his lordship hasn't told us the whole truth about the harpy frenzy. Anyway, I'm not leaving this house until I find something that sheds light on what Deal is up to. Yeah, then we're gonna both have a look. Then we're gonna be faster. Uh, time is of the essence, I'd say. Hey, I wanted to go into the coffer before, so let's do that. Files, awls, and other tiny implements make up what appears to be some manner of lure-making kit. Well, we're in the fishing hut, so... I don't say that's too suspicious. Foul smelling chest contains a surprising number of rotten fish. Rotten. Is that evidence that this is supposed to look like a fishing cabin, but it's just set up to look like one because it's not really used because this is all rotten already? Um, why am I looking you just standing there? <sighs> I have to do everything myself. Whatever secrets urns one help have been removed. Uh, this is not helping. Okay, I have a feeling about the rug, but let's see uh, about everything else first. So let's go with the fish. I like the other fish around the room. This particular one smells surprisingly fresh, prepared with the right amount of spice. It might even be considered edible. Only one edible fish in this fishing cabin. Oh, great. Um, can I? Yeah. This is way better. Okay, we have three bottles here. Are they all the same? The bottles are filled with a strange pungent liquid. It doesn't smell very healthy. Is it poison? Hopefully not. Okay, so the rug it is then. Yeah, I think there's nothing else. Rug. Contract. Examine. Two fishermen, Halvir, Miltrell, and company. Okay, I'm gonna skip this because this is gonna be really long. Uh, as your conversations, uh, sign contract. Uh, you should have also received the boss of Elixir that will cause the effect we desire. What kind of effect? This is getting weird. I have the uh, Apply the contents of a full bottle to your daily haul of fish, then leave the treaded fish for the harpies to feast upon. So he's giving them fish with this elixir? 
We should begin to see the effects within a matter of days. As the harpies consume the tainted fish, they will become aggressive. So he made them aggressive. The birds will have to be dealt with. Once they are eliminated, we can expand Daggerfall down to the coast and increase our investment a hundredfold. Secrecy is imperative. In the meantime, I will hire another group to procure harpies and their eggs. We might as well make a profit from those creatures while we're at it. No one needs to know this. Okay, so it is for the money. I was thinking he has a weird fetish, but... I don't know. Maybe he's combining both, but just not telling it to the fisherman. Um, we're just doing a uh, civil duty bubble. Okay. You found something, didn't you? What is it? Tell me what you found. I found the contract. We can use this as evidence if the guard's gonna, um, ask us so he doesn't blow his money around just to get you captured or something. We have hard evidence. Let me see that. What in the name of... Lord Deal's been poisoning the Harpies the entire time. He orchestrated their frenzy. And he claimed he's been trying to help. He's been using us. It's tainted gold. The daggers don't operate that way. We're not common thieves that break the law just to fill our own pockets. This is a dangerous edge to walk. And it cuts both ways. I didn't want the daggers to start out like this. Well, we'd have to disband. We'd go our separate ways and hope we can find a way to feed our families. Damn it. This isn't an easy choice. I just can't accept that we'd get our start helping a noble do the wrong thing. Yeah, I'm thinking they're gonna have to turn the money down. I think if they don't, their group will break from not being what they want it to be anyway. But if they do the right thing here, maybe they're gonna get gold another way. Maybe because of the good deed, other people will hire them because they are reliable. So, I'm for this. And it fits you, of course. I can see the worry in his face, what I'm gonna say. You just wanna hear that. Just admit it. Of course, you're right. Deal has to be stopped. I think I know what to do. And if all else fails, I've always been good at improvisation. Okay, how can I help? You've done enough. Just keep Lord Deal busy. It's not up to you to finish this. That's work for the daggers. Even if it turns out to be our last job, we're going to do it right. Okay, then let's head back and distract him. Ah, there he is. Should be too hard. Do I still have any eggs in my pocket? Look shiny and oval. Yelvin's sister gave up his location so easily. Now where is that damn thief? And where in the eight is my damn egg? What did you say? How dare you? Yeah, I That's see you back my there. Property. You expect to get away with this? I knew I shouldn't have put my trust in a bunch of low life scum. You'll be in the hands of the Daggerfall Guard by the end of day. Hmm, really? Ah, how fitting. You think the Guard would believe you? Some street rats who lay a claim against a well-respected noble? You're dumber than you look. The Guard will chuckle as they lead you to the dungeons. Or maybe we'll just end this right now. If you look behind you, we might end this. Yeah, and actually, the king kind of would never believe you because I just saved his life. You? Friends with the king? Oh, that's brilliant. Really, it is. You must uh, dine with his family on a regular basis? <laughs> Perhaps vacation together in the countryside? I'll give him your regards. It's a shame about your tragic accident and all. Guards! Ah, oh, this is gonna be nice. Guards, what in the divine's name are you? Ah, <sighs> wonderful. But we now please free the others. Oh lord, why is they are probably already gone? 